Okay, so my first day up here at Mackinac City, priceless. Let me tell you, if there's anything I enjoy doing, <clears throat> it's getting up really early in the morning. And I'm talking like 04, 04.30, take a quick shower, grab some last minute items, and get in my vehicle and be on the road before 05. And let me tell you, when I'm driving up here, I'm listening to some good music, uh, waiting for that sunrise to come up. And when it does, and I'm surrounded by all the lovely trees and nature, you know, it's, it's just soothing and relaxing. It is practically my type of therapy. Um, <clears throat> so, when I first arrived here, I actually originally stopped at uh, St. Agnes. I was there for like an hour or so, just checked out a couple of things. Then eventually I decided to come back here to the city. Um, one of the many first things that I did is I was walking walking along the shoreline there, just admiring the bridge, um, the lake. Nice, beautiful day for me. Um, later on, after I grabbed a couple of snacks, I went in my room, took a little nap, and then got up and I walked into the city. Checking out a few shops, you know, just walking around, and uh, <clears throat> One thing that's really cool about Mackinac, you get a lot of performers. Uh, there was a guy doing magic tricks. I mean, you get a lot of guys that come, I don't know where they come from, but they they like to do small shows. Like you do, like you'll see guys that will perform small acrobat shows or magic shows, and it's actually pretty entertaining. Um, later on, I went to go see the movie Thor, Love and Thunder. As a kid, I was always into the Batman, Superman type thing, but as I got older, I just grew out of it. The one type of superhero movie I am kind of into is Guardians of the Galaxy. Uh, a, a co-worker of mine introduced me to that, which is the one reason why I went to go see Thor, Love and Thunder. <clears throat> but either way, the movie was spectacular. If, if any of you have never seen it, I would highly recommend it. And um, after that, I it was still pretty sunny out. It was like 6.30-ish when I got out. There was still a lot of sunlight left. Um, just walked around a couple of shops bought me some sunglasses, which I had not done in years. Um, then I decided to come back to the hotel. I was thinking about going out and grabbing myself a, an actual meal, considering the only thing I've had anything all day was a Red Bull, some popcorn, and a Dr. Pep. <laughs> but with all the excitement I've had for today, my mind and my body was just basically saying you just need to relax just go back to the hotel grab something good to eat tomorrow and you know what that's fine by me the popcorn really helped out <laughs> so for the time being i'm just enjoying this nice lovely evening show you what it's like Love that bridge, especially at nighttime. You got all the colorful lights on it. <clears throat> so I'm just gonna sit here and enjoy this wonderful evening with a good bottle of bubbly and a nice cigar. Let me tell you, I've been looking forward to this all year. You know, just as we able to sit out here, enjoy a nice evening. Yeah, let me tell you, Mackinac City is just one of those places I just love to come and see. I mean, a lot of people like to come up here. 
and appreciate all that it can offer. And cigar time. used this thing in almost 10 years. I'm kind of surprised it works. Well, at any rate, bottoms up. Ooh, that's good. At any rate, um, that's about it. Nothing much else to tell. Hope you're all enjoying yourselves, and until next time, stay in touch.